For this one, I really wanted to make sure I hadn't done anything like it. And it's a lot more dramatic than anything that I've ever worked on before. So um, that's really what drew me to it most of all. And um, I really love the cast that we're working with. We've got an excellent cast. And the director, of course, I had worked with him before six years ago. And he's really great. My character, Terry, in the movie is a really sweet, completely normal girl, just like everybody else. But she sings, and she has a very good, a very, um, well, an extreme talent for writing. And, um, but she, she lives in this family in Flagstaff, Arizona, which is kind of a small town. And, you know, she works at the family restaurant. And her dad has never really been very open-minded about letting her go out and do, do her dream, you know, which is singing and stuff. Her mom's always been supportive, and so is her brother. But um, she finds this summer music program that she wants to go to in L.A., and she finds out that she gets accepted. But her dad won't let her go. You're creating this character, which is so much fun. And you really get to give it characteristics and this, that, and the other, and try and understand where it's coming from. And then the music, you're, you're like, you're, it's all about yourself. It's so personal. And you're on stage, and you're just right there in front of all of it. And this rush that it gives you is just incredible. So, Working with Rita is so amazing. We had most, most of our scenes together were sad, dramatic scenes. And just. I could look at her, and if she started to cry, I started to cry. Like, if it was about, you know, we had lots of bonding moments together in the movie where, like, there's not much talking, and we're just, like, crying together, you know? And working with her just made it so easy for me to, like, feel those emotions and this and the other just because she's so amazing. And she really just throws herself into it, so I did it right along with her. Sean is the funniest, funniest director. He's so great and he's so quick, which is what I really like about him. But he really knows what's right and he helps the actors a lot. You know, he'll say, maybe you should try like this, or like this. And um, we know that we have to keep going until he says, genius. And that's the word that, you know, we can go on to the next scene or whatever. One thing that I want them to take away from it is that. A lot of kids, you know, do have to go through tragic things, and I want them to be able to know that they're not alone and to see that other people feel pain and all different kinds of stuff like that. And also I want them to feel very inspired to go out and do something if they have a dream that they want to focus on or they want to work at to go for it because anything can happen. There's one with me and John Corbett that was one of my favorites because it's not really a musical scene, but it's... um. I'm just kind of like rehearsing with him and he does all these funny things like to try and make me loosen up because I'm so nervous at first and he like makes me lift my chin up and me use my diaphragm and he started making me flap my wings and he's just so creative and it was really funny and it showed a good bond between us.